You. You're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. The same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. But they hadn't been looking for you. Could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's these Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the Rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella, Kinnereth, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. Who are they, Daddy? Where are they going? To go inside the house. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Oh. Yes, Papa. Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, oh, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We weren't with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you?
You picked a bad time to come home to Skyrim, Kinsman. Captain, what should we do? She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least you'll die here, in your homeland. Follow the Captain, prisoner. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the Eight Divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. Our... As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. And you say the same. You Imperial bastards! Justice! Death to the Stormcloaks! As fearless in death as he was in life. This again. Did you hear that? I said next prisoner. To the block prisoner. Nice and easy. General Tolias has joined the defense. God's guy. Stay close to the wall! Quickly, follow me!
against this guy. Fine, I hope that dragon takes you all to Sovereign Guard. You, come on, into the keep. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here, let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. May as well take Ganyar's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. All right, get that armor on. And give that axe a few swings. I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. Ah, this one's locked. Let's see about that gate. No way to open this from outside. Maybe one of these Imperials had the key. Unlock that door and let's get out of here. That's it. Come on, let's get out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower down on our head. Dragon doesn't give up easy. Grab everything important and let's move. Dragon's burning.
See if you can find any... Oceans. We'll need them. Done? Let's get moving. Hear that? Was Jarl Ulfric with you? No, I haven't seen him since the dragon showed up. Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this cage. Ah, it's locked. See if you can get it open with some picks. We might need that gold once we get out. Grab anything useful and let's go. See where this goes. Hold up! 
There's a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. Let's try to sneak by. Just take it nice and slow. Watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this bow. Might take her by surprise. Sneak. <laughs> like the way out. I knew we'd make it. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. I guess you get used to it. These are the Guardian Stones, three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself. Warrior, good. Those stars will guide you to honor and glory. Remember, this isn't Stormcloak territory. If we're ahead of the news from Helgen, we should be fine. As long as we don't do anything stupid. If we run into any Imperials, just let me do the talking.
I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Like nobody here knows what happened yet. Come on, come on. Gerda's probably a working dragon. in her lumber mill. What? What is it now, Mother? It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It flew right over the barrel. <laughs> Dragons now, is it? Please, Mother. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. And I've got better things to do than this. Not. Gerda. Brother, Mara's mercy, it's good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerda. We heard that Ulfric had been captured. Gerda, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe her my life, in fact. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Hod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. What is it, woman? Stand drunk on the job again? Hod, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? You there. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? You're not paying attention, then, like almost everyone else around here. Haven't you heard that the Hall of the Vigilance was destroyed by vampires? They never took the threat seriously, and now they've paid the price. The Vigilance mostly hunt down Daedra worshippers, which is why they got torn to pieces when they went up against vampires. That's why our leader, Isran, is re-establishing the Dawn Guard, real serious vampire hunters. Ha! <laughs> Isran's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawnguard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawnguard material. What's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Ooh, where to start? Well, the news you heard about Alfred was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards. They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real live? I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. 
Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Thanks, sister. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but... Did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It'll take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric Stormcloak. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Good luck, brother. I'll see you later. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay low. I told you my sister would help us out. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. Just head north. You can't miss it. It's the capital of Whiterun Hold. Jarl Balgruf still hasn't declared for one side or the other. So at least you won't run into any Imperials along the way. Damn right. Just like all true sons of Skyrim should. You should come to Windhelm with me and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. Well, maybe not. Dragons haven't been seen in Skyrim for an age or more. But wherever that dragon came from, and whatever it wants, Ulfric will get to the bottom of it. You can count on that. Besides, you have your own score to settle with the Empire now. And with that dragon. I hope so. Skyrim needs people like you to fight for her freedom. Come on, you better get moving. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a, a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. So this is your plan, Lucan? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. The sooner you... F oh, a bit of this and a bit of that.
Don't let... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Till next time. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Is it time yet? Time for me to make my sword? Or maybe an axe? Late a little. I need to finish my work. But keep watching. Watch. I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Such a child. Mara bless you for agreeing to help us. Good luck. Lucan and I will be waiting for you back in the shop. Get a new batch. Did you hear we me? got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. Yep, ale's going bad. You're that visitor been poking around. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. something
strong. Come to your basker. Head you handle yourself man. well. You could make for a decent shield, sister. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the Companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlac Whitemane up in your Vaskar. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. If you go to him, good luck. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. Got to go. Blood on the wind today. Good hunt ahead of us. I'm here to help. Fight with us and you'll have stories to tell. Come up to your Vasker, if you're worth anything in you a fight. You look strong. Come to your Vasker and be a companion. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. I'm here to help. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Well met, kinsman. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madran. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You'd do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Yeah, these Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. Worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Nobody trusts them. Reputation, mostly. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. Farewell. I heard they were forming a dawn guard. 
vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Might consider joining up myself. Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. You should talk to the Yar up in Dragon's Reach. Lend any aid you can. I am the chosen of Talos. I am alone. Lady, could you spare a coin? Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. It's... It's what Brennan said I should do. He's the only one that's been nice to me since... Since Mama. Since she died. My aunt and uncle took over our farm and threw me out. Said I wasn't good for anything. I wound up here, but I, I don't know what to do. I miss her so much. Bye. I'm the commander of the guard here in White. You were once man. I am ass man, you said. Let me show you the power of Talos Storm Crown, born of the North. I Where my bread There's is a long winter. I breathe now in royalty and reshape this land which is mine. I do this for you, red legions, for I love you. I love, love, even as man, great Talos, cherished us, for he saw in us in each of us, the future of Skyrim, the future of Tamriel. And there it is, friends, the ugly. We are the children of man. Talos is the true God of man. As if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. Well, there's no telling what it means. What would you have me do then? Nothing? My lord, please. What's the meaning of this, this interruption? Is no rash Jarl Balgruff is not receiving visitors. We act. I just... As Housecarl, my job is to deal with all dangers that threaten the Jarl or his people. So you have my attention. Now explain yourself. Whatever you have to say to the Jarl, you can say to me. I'm right, starting to think... I want to hear what she has to say. What's this about Riverwood being in danger? Gerda owns the lumber mill, if I'm not mistaken. Pillar of the community, not prone to flights of fancy. And you're sure Helgen was destroyed by a dragon? This wasn't some Stormcloak raid gone wrong? Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute, especially now. What I want to know is, what exactly happened at Helgen? Hmm. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... The Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... Enough! I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people! Irelet, send a detachment to Riverwood huh? at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, what? I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done Whiterun a service, and I won't forget it. Here, 
Take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Farengar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Varengar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill her in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me? Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia will provide some form of recompense. Well, let's see. Travel-stained clothes, worn souls, blank and unintelligent expression. Yes, in fact, you do. You know, this if you've got the aptitude, now. you should join Anything the Mage's College in Winterhold. Dragon or dragons. You need it quickly. Or you win! Late. I submit! Where are you? Just a scratch. You can't win this! The guy has no place here! Die, damn you! That it? It's the best! By the order of the law. Stop right there! You have found me an able assistant. I'm sure You're going to rot in the Dragon's Reach dungeon. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. In the old fort near Rift. Might consider joining up as I do. What then? Who the hell? Speak your bones? Your 
businesses, your children, your very luck. It again. Watch the eye fight. Come on. You're pathetic. Get him. Pull him back. This should be good. Going to enjoy killing you. You dare fight a Dunmer? Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. You don't just waddle in here and get to speak to the boss. Who do you think you are? If you want to embarrass yourself, I won't stop you. Codlack is the harbinger. He's the closest thing you'll find to a leader around here. All right, then. No fighting just yet. Not till Skior says so. We train now. But I still hear the call of the blood. We all do. It is our burden to bear. But we can overcome. You have my brother and I, obviously. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. A stranger comes to our hall. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Hmm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting her. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasker for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, girl? That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Vilkas, take her out to the yard and see what she can do. I...
Here to be a companion? Well, they just let me in, so there's probably no more room. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry, I can take it. I can take her. Not bad. Pretty good on Not bad. Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. What brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. That attitude would get you far, if you were some stuffy merchant or a Jarl's footstool. Around here, you'll want to learn to live your own life. Remember, nobody rules anybody in the Companions. I have a favor to ask. I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. Well done. Servant, dear. You want to talk to one of the companions, I'm sure. I haven't seen your face before. I'm watching you. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. You know this one? I saw her training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkus catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkus in a real fight? Whoa, he's up there. We're rough, but there's no need to kill a shield brother over a dispute. I like your fire, though. You'll make a fierce companion. Let us hunt together sometime. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Icebrain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Skior and Aella like to tease me, but they're good people. One day when you they and challenge I us for the blood our running hot. I've been tending to the. I don't think nice to have a new face around. Well, it gets boring here sometimes. Lording it over us all the time. I hope we keep you. This can be a Young rough life. The smart ones know the ones. They've been. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tell me we'll keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. I haven't seen Welcome you before, have I? Have we met? 
I'm sorry if I've forgotten. A man of my station has many debts. I'm not much use at labor or learning, but I can throw a punch with the best of them. The companions let me fight for gold, and so I fight. It means when I have troubles, I always have someone on my side. We have shield siblings to keep our backs as dangerous as our fronts. I think. Until next time. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Go. Bring honor to yourself. And the companions. The latest recruit, right? Wait, is that right? If the Circle vouches for you, I'm sworn to respect their judgment. But that doesn't mean I like it. So I wouldn't have to answer stupid questions from idiots. Just because you've been accepted here so quickly, don't think I'm gonna help you rise any faster. Fight well, don't be a lout, and you'll be fine. You don't need my help. Until next time. I was the newest companion until... Oh, hey there. I killed a bear yesterday. Did you kill anything? Are you kidding? I've wanted to be with them since I was a little girl. Haven't you heard the stories of Kodlak and Skior fighting off the 101 Orc Berserkers? Skior says it was more like 40, but he's just being modest. Where else would I want to be but here? Learning from them, fighting at their sides. So much. This group, this family, this band. This is the best thing I've ever been a part of. The oldest fighting group in Skyrim, and nothing but glory from Iskramor's day to our own. To be counted in that line is a bit of immortality. Even if I never see Sovngarde, I'll have that much. Until next time. I see everything, hear everything, and know everything. Need something? I'm still trying to figure out why Skior let you in in the first place. The latest recruit, right? Wait, is that right? I never thought they would actually let me join the Companions. But now it looks like they're letting anyone in these days. I avoid going to East March if I can. Something in the air. I think it's just too close to the border. Are you thinking you're better than me? I crawled west out of the wasteland, so show some respect. Watch it there, sister. I never thought they would actually let me join the companions. But now it looks like they're letting anyone in these days. I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Perhaps we can hunt together someday.
spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. I need more experience if I'm going to run an ancient. The Jarl has finally agreed to send you back to Riverwood. Some advice, friend. Will that armor me? won't offer much protection. It's just us against the dragon. Is that it? I can't afford to send anyone else. And we don't know where the dragon is. Your men are keep an eye on it. It's a safety of the town of the town. We've got small weapons as well as big. Maces, daggers, that sort of thing. You can't scare me into submission. Let's go. Come on. Huh? Tougher than you look. You got me, fair and square. Fine, I'll take care of it. Just please leave me alone. You look like maybe you need a new weapon. Something big, perhaps? An axe, maybe? Or a great sword? Most of our weapons were crafted. Hmm. Blades, helmets. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Good doing business with you. Rorik stands a nice enough little hamlet, but a boring posting for a god. If a dragon attacks, well, then it would be a different story. Chops and steaks fit for a yarl. I can see myself at the table without his appointment. I can barely tolerate our presence on Earth. Today, they take away your favorite. But tomorrow. Some people don't think I'm smart. Those people get my fist. But you, I like. Kind of fun to push people around sometimes, isn't it? Good work, sister. Skior was looking for you earlier. Don't know. He just said he needed to talk to you before you do anything else. I don't like making him angry. But there is some work for you if you want it. Some of them might try. That's not what I'm worried about. What then? That they might get themselves killed. By you? They should be so lucky. <coughs> I've, I've heard you there you are. actually be stronger than you look. 
Perhaps we can hunt. I did. Your time, it seems, has come. Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wuthrad. He seemed a fool to me, but if he's right, the honor of the Companions demand that we seek it out. There's a fine line between respect and bootlicking, How do you manage blood. To hold your ground but I like your spirit. You have to remember, We've decided this will be your strength. trial. It's Do well, and you'll be counted among the companions. Hurt. Farkas will well, be your no. shield sibling on this venture, more to well. than muscle. He'll answer any questions you have. Try not to disappoint, or to get him killed. Don't let them intimidate you, sister. We both know how to keep our heads, while the men let their hearts rule. It's good to have another quick-eyed shield sister in the hall. Come to me with any troubles. <coughs> we Grey Mains have been feuding with the Battleborns for years. There's no more bitter enemy than an old friend. My advice? Don't overthink it. Fight well and the rest takes care of itself. Well, when you get to be my age, you don't remember why you did much of anything. Only that it happened. Oh, we've got an old saying. The Grey Manes have lived in Whiterun since the first snows fell in Skyrim. Well, maybe that's not entirely true. But our clan's got a long and proud history in this old. We respect the old ways, the Nord ways. And the Grey Mane has worked the Skyforge since before the time of my grandfather's father. Heard you had a bit of trouble near Aye. We used to be fast friends. So it was long ago. We were two of the city's oldest and most respected clans. And we could trace our histories all the way back to Isgrimor's companions. But then Olford got rich and decided he and his kin were too good for us simple, backwards Nord folk. When the troubles began, he took the Empire's side. We haven't spoken much since then. Aye, they're an old clan like ours. But they cast their lot with the Empire when the uprising began. Olfred Battleborn made his money from farming, and got himself some new friends among the Empire's nobles. Now he's in the Emperor's pocket like the rest of them, with no regard for honor and tradition. I was done talking anyway. Come to me with questions. I know our history almost as well as Vignar by now. Except I can remember it. I hope you've read it yourself. So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. A smart man came and told us about a blade piece. Skior thinks you should find it, and I'm supposed to watch you. I watch you to make sure you're honorable. If you are honorable and strong, then I can call you sister. Don't delay, shield sister. <laughs> 